Hi everyone. So this is going to be a very special video and I have to say I am in such high spirits. Um, this month is the month of Ramadan for Muslims worldwide and I have been observing the last 17 days of Ramadan and it has been such a rewarding and fulfilling experience this year. This is the first year that I actually was able to take off the whole month of Ramadan and not do any decorating, any work, anything that will take me or take my focus away from what I'm supposed to be focusing on and thinking about and doing. Sometimes we get so caught up with working all the time that it takes our focus, sometimes even prayer, um, away. And so this year I said I'm going to dedicate my Ramadan to Allah as always, but I'm going to leave off work. So I have been MIA for the last three weeks because I've been preparing myself for Ramadan, but I also have not been doing any decor events just so that I can gain a closeness to Allah and I can really focus on the importance of Ramadan so that I can come out of Ramadan like a newborn baby, they say. So that is exactly what I've been doing. So if you've been wondering where I've been um, and not posting anything, any videos, um, any decor events, this is what I've been doing. I've been in solitude. I've had the pleasure of being around my family. I've had the pleasure of attending Ramadan iftars at the masjid, which has also been a blessing. And we were able to obtain a grant from Islamic Relief USA that allowed us to feed those in need each night during Ramadan, as well as tonight, um, we would be also putting together an event that will be hosting um, the mayor from the city of Kansas City, as well as the councilwoman, uh, Melissa Robinson, as well as some guests from out of town. So tonight we're gonna to be setting up a very special event. So this was the only event that I said that I would do this month because it is Ramadan focus. It is a community-wide iftar, um, which is open to all of Kansas City and the surrounding cities. And so I'm very excited to be doing this. It brings me much joy because um, it allows us to really focus in on the importance of community life and bringing communities together uh, from all ethnicities and backgrounds, especially during the month of Ramadan. And so today we're going to be setting up an event, an install at the Dynasty event space. So this is one of the few events that I actually go out of the venues that I own to set up um, for this install. I'm very excited because I have a lot of stuff that I'm bringing out. So you're gonna be seeing me get a U-Haul. Um, Khalees is going to be setting up marquee letters and um, I have a couple of people coming out that's going to be bringing out um, some of their items as well, such as Umi's catering and rentals. Her um, sister Sincere has a lot of nice designer wear that she's gonna be bringing out to complement the tablescaping. So I'm really excited to see what she has available. And then we have a couple of installs that I did and I'm gonna show that to you too um, in the process. So I'm so excited about this. I hope you guys like this video and drop me a comment and like and share and subscribe if you haven't already because this is going to be one of one one of one and i'm so excited So we are now in the U-Haul. We just got loaded up and it's me and 
with Sahara right now. Say hi, Sahara. Hi. <laughs> so we are in the U-Haul. We're heading down to the Dynasty event space and we're gonna get ready to unload and start um, prepping. Some of the people are there already to help set up. So that's a plus, that's a plus. And um, yeah, it's gonna be a good day. Also, I don't know why I forgot to mention this, but we just welcomed a grandchild, okay? So Kali's older son, Keyshawn, shout out to Keyshawn. Um, he just had a baby son. He just had a baby boy. His name is Kymir. So welcome to the preeminent props family. Kelly's all already has his tool belt and everything ready for him. So we are excited for our new grandbaby. So shout out to Kaya and Keyshawn who often comes out and helps for some of our events. Um, you see them in some of the videos, but they just welcomed a baby boy. So that's the first grand and one of, uh, one of soon to be many, hopefully, um, God willing. So we are totally excited. Welcome Kymir. Assalamu alaikum, good people. So, look at Fonte. So, this is a space today that we are working with. We got Sister Fonte, we got Sahara, we got preeminent props, Khalees in the building. King Khalees, okay.
today is day two of setting up and we are actually done we are done so you will see we didn't get done until like 8 30 last night and so i was tired too tired to do a video montage but we are done and you guys are going to see what it looks like it looks so beautiful i brought the majesty vases out those came out really good and you're gonna see what ramadan looks like in kansas city for us it's a community-wide iftar featuring a lot of different people from our community they're gonna be coming out and enjoying just listening to quranic recitation praying together eating fellowship and just listening to community life okay Congratulating MACAA and the Al Haq Islamic Center. Whereas MACAA is a Kansas City based 5123 non for profit organization founded by a man. He represents hope for every child born without a father. Thank you. 